even know what a 203k loan is? Do you know how to use one to buy a house in today's market? To buy the ugly house and make it exactly what you want? Well, you're about to learn. I'm Gary Meek with Living in Sacramento. Ben Johnston with Movement Mortgage here in Roseville. Cool. And we're gonna share with you guys what's going on in today's market using this loan product that you guys may have never even heard of. It's called a 203K or 203KS. Just give us some of the details, Ben. Yeah, so a 203K loan, um, it's an FHA loan, so it's federally insured, similar to an FHA loan that you would use normally. Mm -hmm. This actually incorporates repairs into the equation. Okay. So you can actually get a home, or even if you already have a home, you can refinance, but you can use the money to fix it up and do certain repairs or improvements that you want to do to the property. Cool. So as a real estate agent, I'm out there every single day showing property and I see beautiful homes and everybody wants something that's dialed in exactly what they want. And at least now there's a little more inventory. There's a little bit more to choose from. But what about that house that was grandma's house that's got wallpaper everywhere, orange shag carpet, the old laminate um, countertops, what if you could rip out that kitchen, put in new white shaker cabinets, do tile floors or laminate or paint it or rip out a wall? What if you could do all those things and actually make that house exactly what you want with your taste and everything all in one loan? Yeah, it's a really great program. So there's a couple guidelines. One, you can't do luxury items. Okay. So unfortunately, you can't use the money to put in a swimming pool, but pretty much anything else goes. Um, like you said, you can do new finishes, you can do flooring, bathrooms, kitchens, paint, whatever you want to do to that property, you can use the 203K for. And there's two versions, like you said. Yeah. So the Streamline allows you to do a budget of $35,000, and then the full 203K actually gives you up to $100,000. And a little bit about the financing part, so the way it works is you can still do a three and a half percent down payment, but they take three and a half percent of the after improved value. So with a 203K, there's basically two appraisals done. Okay. Um, and it's really helpful to organize everybody to be at the property on the same day. So what you're gonna want is a contractor, an appraiser, and then there's a HUD consultant as well. So you show up at the property and the appraiser is gonna give two values to the home. The first value is the home as is. So let's say the property is on the market for $400,000, but like you said, it's nasty and it needs to be updated. Yep. The appraiser is gonna talk to the contractor and get a list of items that they bid out that you want to have done, and then they'll give it an after improve value. Okay. So let's say it's worth 400,000 today, after improvements, let's say we finance $35,000 worth of repairs and improvements. After those are done, the appraiser says, okay, the house is gonna be worth $500,000 when we're all said and done. So you would put 3.5% of your $500,000 and that's your initial investment to get in the door. Okay. So the repairs are, are financed that way. Okay, so if I, if I got a client that likes a house at 400,000 and we put mm -hmm. 35,000 in repairs, it's really only gonna bring the value to 435, right? So that's the loan amount, is that right? Well, yeah, it could be. Again, okay. that's up to the appraiser's determination. Okay. So whatever they think would give that value. So they'll probably pull comps of, you know, maybe a house in that area that has had a facelift and has been remodeled. Okay. And they'll determine the after repaired value as that. Okay, awesome. Yep. So for those of you that are think, hey, this house is old, it's got single pane windows, hey, maybe it needs a new roof. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe like I said before, you wanna tear out a wall, you wanna blow out the kitchen, you don't want a little galley style kitchen. This gives you the opportunity to work with your contractor, with your spouse, and design your amazing, beautiful house. I was actually out in Rio Linda uh, about a week ago, and I found a bank repo that was listed at $300,000 and I ran the comps and fully remodeled, it was probably worth about 500,000. And I think it's only about 100,000 in repairs. It needed windows, the yep. roof was in good shape, the floor plan was decent, and it was on a half acre. So if you could put in $100,000 in value, did the full 203K loan, yep. that's $400,000 in total loan, but the house might be worth 500,000. That's actually equity position for you brand new homeowners 
to be able to move into it where people that bought six, eight months ago, they were bidding 100,000 over to try and get those properties. Now you're gonna be able to get those deals and you're gonna be able to possibly have an equity position already. So that's why I love this loan so much. Yeah, I think it's a great program. Like you said, it hasn't been super common for the last few years, but um, just like you said, I think it's a great opportunity to maybe find a property that's sitting. Because a lot of people, if they don't know about this program and they see a house that needs a new roof, they're gonna say, shoot, I talked to my loan officer and he already said I can't get a house that needs a new roof. Well, they might not know about the 203K program mm -hmm. and that'd be a great opportunity to get that house. Yeah, you know, as an agent, I'm out there looking around and we have agents, unfortunately, that don't quite understand all the programs that are out there. So they'll put things like cash only and they're mm -hmm. pricing those properties considerably under market because they think only a cash investor will buy them. Well, if you can help educate that agent to what your buyer's doing and the fact that you've done these, then you'll be able to say, hey, listen, at least give us a shot. If they have no other offers, you have a great offer for them. And yeah, the FHA 203K and the KS both take a little bit longer because you have the uh, bid you need to get, the HUD consultant. So you might want to plan for like a 60 day escrow. Does that sound about right, 60 days? Yeah, usually we'll ask for 45 to 60 okay. days to get one of these closed just because there is that extra piece gotcha. and the extra people involved. Cool, sounds good. So as a uh, bank repo specialist back in 2008, 9, 10, 11, I actually did a ton of these. And as the market shifted and changed, people didn't really have that opportunity to use these. And I think we're really in the market right now that we're gonna be able to use this a lot. And if your agent doesn't know about it and your lender doesn't know about this program and know how to do one, you may not be in the best position. So reach out to an agent that really knows what's going on, knows how to work a few of these and has done them and we'll be able to get you in a position to get the house that you really, really want, design it exactly like you want, paint it exactly like you want, all the finishes you want, and for a really great price. Yeah, absolutely, I agree. Cool, sounds good. Well, thanks for being here, bud. I appreciate you, man. Right on, thank cool. you, Gary. Thanks, guys. Good luck out there, and if you need any help with 203K um, deals, reach out to myself, Gary Meek, or? Ben Johnston, Movement Mortgage. Cool, thanks, guys. Appreciate you. Take care.